In this video we're going to show you the three ways of working in polyboard. First of all we have cabinet mode. This is where you design individual pieces of furniture one at a time. So we can enter cabinet mode by clicking on the new cabinet icon but let's load up a cabinet we've already made. So here we're in the edit window of cabinet mode. This is where we make changes to our design. We can also click on this 3D icon to view our design in 3D. Let's just show both these views side by side. Now you can design very quickly anyway in polyboard, but to make it even faster we recommend you build up a library of models over time. It's then easy to open these up for future jobs and modify them if required. Let's close down cabinet mode now and move into the second way of working, project mode. We can click here to start a new project, but let's open up a project we've already got ready for you. So in project mode you place multiple cabinets in a project environment, which is normally going to be a room layout. You first create the environment and then add furniture to it. We can make changes in the project mode edit window here, or again we can view our project in 3D. So project mode is great for creating client presentations. It's a very useful way to check that all of your cabinets are fitting together in the environment correctly. And if they don't, you can adjust them very easily to fit. Let's go back to the edit window now to note that if you actually want to make a change to an individual unit, you double click on it. This has in fact opened up cabinet mode, which is where you make design changes to the model. You save that close the window and you're back in project mode. Any changes you made will be reflected in project mode as well. A final use for project mode is where you want to split up complex constructions by assembling several simpler cabinets together. We've got examples of that in our other videos. On to our third way of working now, catalog mode. Let's go to file new catalog and I'm going to add a project to this catalog. So what we have now is a list of every unit in that project added to the catalogue. We can see the total price here and we can get all the manufacturing documents for everything in this catalogue. You can in fact add not just one project but as many as you want or a long list of individual units. We can still edit every single model in a number of ways. For now let's just change the quantity of this wall shelf. So if we look over here we'll see that that price has now updated. And if we go into our workshop document, we can see that we've got the manufacturing output. Here's the cut list for every single item in that catalogue. That includes plans and CNC files. So this makes catalogue mode great for fast and accurate bulk manufacture. So those are our three modes or ways of working inside Polyboard. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.